chicken burger from KFC, hence the KFC bag, the vegan one, let me just put this out there first, um, so yeah, I haven't had KFC in about, um, like five years, maybe four, I don't know, um, I don't know, yeah, five years, because I, yeah, wow, okay, I'm going to be trying the vegan chicken burger, this is like the first ever like proper like chicken burger that I've tried, um that is meant to be vegan or that is vegan so yeah so i'm i don't know i'm excited because i've heard like good reviews about the last time that they had something going on and like before it was it was only in like selected stores whereas now it's like everywhere so that's good so yeah, this is the little packaging yeah found now okay from just the smell, it smells like what a mini fillet smells like and I know I shouldn't be able to remember that smell but I remember it because my mum doesn't eat, well, my mum my isn't vegan so like sometimes she will have her, she'll have like a mini fillet burger so like it smells the same as like what her one smells like um whoa okay where's the sauce like dry bun but like just bread okay cool um so this is like a corn patty apparently they have a bit of like vegan mayo I guess so, but it's missing other sauce, so let me, hold on, what's that, okay. Lighting. The lighting gonna come back, oh my, that looks so messy. Let me just, okay, it's messy there as well, let me just keep it here. Yeah, they're missing the vegan sriracha mayo, which is vegan anyway, so. Let me add that one here, onto the bun. Like it's just dry. Well, I feel like without this sauce I'm putting on, it'll just be dry. So like, no, you need to have a sauce, flavor. Like, what are you doing? I'll see how it feels with just this little piece. But no me, I probably would want more sauce. Well, let's just try it, okay. Also, let me quickly point this out. They have the meal with chips and a drink, but the chips on KFC aren't vegan. So why would you have the chips included like i thought like they should they kind of messed up with that part there they should either have like a, se a section where they have like chips that are suitable for vegans which is ridiculous because chips are but the way they cook it isn't or they should just have like a thing you can substitute the meal for rather than have chips maybe have like i don't know i don't know but something else you can substitute the like chips in the meal with because it's kind of like say basically someone's just buying a burger and a drink because they can't have the chips so they're spending basically almost five pound on a burger and drink when they could have a meal but they can't have the meal because only that yeah okay anyway, let's just try this so let me go from this end because there seems to be more sauce Sauce really helped you know it needs some more sauce I'll we'll say that first of all um it's all right from what I remember chicken tasting like or like from how I remember KFC's like flavoring on their chicken it doesn't taste the same but it tastes like it tastes like what chicken burger would taste like kind of thing I guess this makes it a lot better let me just put that out there way better I'm so sorry if this is like too much ASMR like <laughs> so let me just try this piece on its own yeah it hasn't got the same flavoring like KFC's burgers used to like the kind of zinger burger or whatever like the actual flavoring that KFC's burger that I'm known for. It hasn't got the same one, but it has one that's similar, but it's not the same. 
but it tastes good though it doesn't it, it doesn't taste bad it tastes good i feel like if someone who has never ever had kfc before which is kind of crazy because most people, people in the world have but somebody who hasn't had kfc before or they haven't had like a zinger burger or like a mini filler burger before you can give this to them they probably would be like oh this is good um but I feel like if you've like if you've grown up having like KFC's burgers and like their buckets or whatever, you would be able to taste the difference. I don't think it's meant to replicate the taste exactly. It's just meant to be like a nice option for vegans, which it is. But they need to fix it up with the with the fries because it's pointless not having fried burger and chips. Somebody in the shop while I was um, waiting for my thing to come, somebody got the meal. He, he got two meals, and then the guy was like, oh like. Just to let you know, um, you can't have the chips. And, he, and then like the guy knew, but he still paid for it, which I guess that's on his part, but it's still like, they should have like another option because you're, pay, you're paying the same price for what a meal costs and you're not getting anything else. I didn't get a meal because I was like, nah, I'm not paying for a meal when I, can, when, like, I have water at home, which I don't really, because I don't really drink a lot of fizzy drink or any really. And um, like, you know, I just wanted to taste the burger solely. I don't wanted to get the chips. Well, I can't even get the ship, so like logic, like what? Oh, thumbnail. Mm. I feel like oh, this is sliding everywhere. So I feel like this will not be sliding everywhere if I don't put sauce. The sauce makes the meal. Um, put all this lettuce back on there because you know, veg life. They also need to add more sauce into the burger. Like it's really, really dry. Like I'm not gonna lie. I'm a person who likes sauce in my burgers or just like with anything. And like if something's dry, that's just like ill. So they need to fix up with that. Like, but it's good otherwise. Like it's good. It's good that KFC of all places are having a vegan substitute for something. So that's pretty good. Um, but yeah, that's my review of the KFC vegan burger a lot of people were actually buying it like the same time i was buying it mm. but yeah because when i went in the shop like at least they're like like within the span of five minutes there were like at least six orders maybe seven including mine of the vegan burger alone and like that's actually saying a lot like because i think a lot of people when like a lot of people who have friends that aren't vegan but they are vegan themselves and they want to go out with their friends and eat and the friends want to go to places like you know um KFC or Nando's or McDonald's and like sometimes if you don't have anything to eat you feel a bit like why am I here like what like what but it's nice that they have like an option for vegans I feel like they should do like a more wider um menu but I know that's probably going to come out in the future because you know people are going to request it after this is going to sell out because the other one sold out crazy fast but um yeah I'm going to eat this and then I'll see you guys maybe later on. I'm not sure. I'll be even plan on doing a vlog today. I don't think I'm going to do a vlog because I have work to do, but I might even just vlog me doing work. Anyway, I'm going to go and finish eat this and then I'm going to go and do some work. And yeah, so that's my review of the burger. It's not bad. It's not amazing, but it's, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Um, if you're a person who likes a lot of sauce in your burgers, I would advise having your favourite sauce on hand or something like that just in case the burger is really dry because the patty looks really dry um, and don't get it as a meal personally like, that's my thought don't get it as a meal because it's kind of pointless to get it as a meal because you're, pay you're paying the same amount for something that is just a burger and drink when you can literally get a drink from anywhere else bigger size as well this is like the uni student in me like thinking economically so that's my review um i'm gonna finish this head out head out what am i doing no yeah i'm gonna finish this um do some work and see where my evening takes me okay i'll see you guys later bye okay.